Hey, what's going on guys? So, got another unboxing that I picked up. Um, I'm still without power in my house, my job, where I work in the hotel, there's no power still. It's just been crazy. Been out running around getting ice and all that. Went to Walmart, picked up some stuff. Uh, yeah, it's tiring. Uh, I'm just glad no trees fell on the house. Um, we still have water, running water, so that's a blessing. So yeah, so that's what I'm dealing with, and um, I figured I'd just do this little video. And I have short clips of my hotel with no power or nothing, and I'll put that up next time. But uh, I won't probably be able to put this video up until my power comes back. So yeah, so I went to Walmart, right? So when they got the spider, the chase, chases, um, they had a sale. They usually have them like for 60 something bucks, 25 bucks, I picked it up. I was like, what the heck with it? I mean, it's not maybe one of the, the um, high-end knives, but for for 25 bucks, you can't go wrong. So let me just open this up. I always watch them on YouTube, the, the spider, the spider cool. Um, so I figured, let me just jump on it for 25 bucks. I'm like, what the heck? You know what I mean? And I'm pretty sure, I believe this is like one of the lower ends. This one is made in China. There we go. There you go. It has the lanyard lock, um, Makita handles. Um, this one is kind of cool because this has the four um, position pocket clip. So I can put it up here, down there. You see it's here, I can put it down here. So there goes the knife. No wiggling now. Uh, it feels nice in the hands. It has a little chipping to put your, your finger. It's not bad at all. It has a lanyard hole in the back. Uh, let's see what else. Lanyard lock. Um, the steel is 8GR13 MOV stainless steel blade. Let's move it to the side. It's not bad. I never have one with that has the hole. Um, it snaps pretty good. Um, for 25 bucks in Walmart, they have the knives on sale in Walmart today. So I was like, I gotta get it. So I went and I got it. Because in reality, I'm not gonna spend 100 and something to $200 on a switchblade knife. You know what I mean? But um, yeah, it feels good. I mean, it snaps good, closes good. It's about the right size to be able to put in your pocket and carry as an EDC. Um, it has nice, nice, it's pretty thick too. It's not that thin of a blade. But um, yeah, there you go. Yeah, I picked it up for 25 bucks, man. So I think it's a good steal. I mean, the blade feels sharp. Yeah, it's sharp. Yeah, it's shaving hairs off. Yeah. So yeah, it comes super sharp out the box. So yeah, 25 bucks, go to Walmart. Probably get one for 25 bucks. So I don't know, I think they probably run maybe like for 50 bucks, I think. I don't know, a line maybe. Um, I know when I was going to Walmart, they were 24, I mean, they were 60, like $62. So yeah, I'm glad I went today and picked one up. So yeah, so that's, my find that I found today, so that was good. And um, when I got this light for my EDC, I paid about, I think it was like 14 bucks for this that I paid. Let me just crack this open. This is a pretty good light. Um, 100 numinum pin light. It lasts about three and a half hours. It, has, it just holds two AAA batteries, so not bad at all. I was using something even way cheaper. 
yesterday my job and it worked good too i paid like five bucks on amazon do i have it here no i probably got it somewhere else a little flashlight that i bought which worked real good too there you go um it has a lot of um, for gripping on the sides which is good um you can even use it for self-defense as you can see, has these square lines out the flashlight where you can use it if you really need it to use it for self-defense. And it comes with two AAA batteries, which you can't go wrong for um. There we go. And it's good because triple A's, you know, they're easy to find. You could stock these up too if you had to. So there you go. It's nice and bright. It's not bad at all. It's pretty good. Turns it off. Um, you can even hold it. If you don't want to click it like that, you can just hold it on and off, which I think I find cool. Um, it fits perfect in the hands. You know I mean, you can even put your hair, if you're gonna hit somebody, you're gonna be blind them and you just pop them in the face with it if you had to. <laughs> so yeah, so that's it. I like the gripping on it. It has some nice real gripping on it. But it won't slip out of your hands. Yeah, and it's called a Pro. It's not bad at all. It's pretty good. So yeah, so that's my day. Um, no lights. So I'm hoping I'll be able to put this video up. But I really like the spider coat. It's really nice. It has some nice weight to it too. It's not real light. I mean, you can't go wrong, man. For um, 25 bucks, you got yourself a um, a spider coal. Yeah, that's it for my video, guys. Yeah, and the flashlight for my job because there's no light over there. So, yeah. All right, guys. Until next time, I'll see you. Hopefully, I'll be able to put this video up next week. They say we probably won't have power until Tuesday. Um, I'll put some videos up. Um, and talk maybe talk a little bit about um what's good to have in your house if the power goes out. That works for me. So until next time, guys. Take care. God bless.